Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. This is Eileen with Unique Gifts and Decor by Lady Di. Hope everyone is having a fabulous Tuesday. I am having a great day so far, and I hope it gets better throughout the day, throughout the evening, through the night, you guys. Um, I am so excited just to be alive today. Um, you know, God is good. But I just wanted to show you guys this small, and it's very small haul that I did today. Um, Dollar Journal has the Christmas items today, or oh, this week for 10 cents. Now, I know last week was 25 cents, and I got most of my items that I was looking for last week. But I just wanted to double back in the stores today to see if there's anything that I could add to my stockpile that I... I would say missing, but you know, you can add, you can never have enough ribbon, okay? You guys saw my <laughs> uh, video last week. I did get a lot of ribbon, and I'm not going to uh, sugarcoat anything, you know. I never want to run out of ribbon. And you can always, even the ribbon that I did pick up, you can always add another color to it uh, to signify the uh, occasion or the holiday that you are um, designing for. So, um this is the items that I did get today. So I did get this ribbon combo pack. And as you can see, it is originally $2 and I got it for 10 cents today. I got some more of the red linen, uh, just one roll of the red linen uh, ribbon. And that is was $2 originally, 10 cents today. So everything is 10 cents that I got today, okay? Um, they do also have this red look like the sparkle as well as the gray uh, excuse me the gold sparkle and also i got some of the uh buffalo check the red and black i've got let's see it was two four six seven rolls of those and i also got these um it's the linen material but it's the uh maybe the beige and dark red uh decorative ribbon and I got also two, four, six, seven of those. Then I got these. I like this green. Um, even though it has the pine cones in here, um, you know, we can substitute. We can work around that. <laughs> but I like that color green, and it kind of the green that's in my, uh, pretty much in this in my house, um, downstairs in my living room, as well as um, my family room, and upstairs in my hallway. So I like that kind of green. So I got four of those. And then I got some of this um, white, and it looks like it has the snowflakes in there as well, two of those. And I also got this red and white striped, and it's, this is two, four, seven of those. Also, I got this red and white and gold ribbon as well. And it might be looking more Christmassy, but you can fix it up where it won't be. So I got... Um, they were, these was a dollar originally, but again, everything was 10 cent on here. So it's two, four, six, eight of those. Okay, so let's go back on this side of my island and I'm gonna show you guys um, these floor picks that I got. And these got the berries, the red berries. Um, they were originally a dollar. Um, I got the red, red ones for 10 cent today. And they also had the berries in the white as well i got a bunch of those as well so um you know you can work around those for the holiday or even if you want to do something in a closing basket with the maybe the um off the white ones and something you know the sky's the limit okay that's all i'm trying to say so they also had these packs of the flow of the snowflakes um now i'm gonna sit in the store and like um what can I use these for? And I got a bunch of those. So I'm thinking, you know, I was telling you guys I am doing these chocolate strawberries. And here is one of the boxes I want to show you guys right here. Let's see if we can go down a little bit. You all can see here. So this is the box that I'm going to be using for my strawberries. And it is a large box, okay? So what I plan to do is I'm going to fill it with some um, gift wrapping paper. And I'm going to use these um, snowflakes as fillers, okay? So I won't have to be using a lot of shred. 
Um, I know I've got to do 60 some boxes, but I know I don't have enough of the snowflakes, but it will probably, even if I did one per um, box, I think I got about 15, maybe 16 boxes of the uh, snowflakes. And then I will put the um, strawberries in there in those little baking cups. Maybe put um, a chocolate heart or something in there or even some of the sparkling cider. It just depends on how I'm thinking about designing them today, you guys. So um, that is only things that I came up with today. I know it's a very small haul, but again... You know, I was just out there to see what was out there that was left. They did have a, a lot of the candies. I saw a lot of the candy canes. Um, what else? A lot of the uh, Christmas ornaments was in the stores. Basically, you know, if some if you're looking to stock by, pile some stuff away for Christmas next year, you know, it, it, it's a great opportunity to get those things now. Um, those are not really the things that I do look for. When I'm designing for my holiday home tour every Christmas, some of those ornaments were just not my cup of tea. And it might be yours, that's fine, but it's not mine. So anyway, I left those for someone else to bless somebody else with uh, the $10 items. So um, let me know if you guys went out today and found some items that you all were looking for. Or just kind of like me, just kind of running through and see what's left, what I could use going forward. Again, the ribbon is just not for Christmas. Um, they do have a lot of now. I left some of the a lot of the ribbon that had ho 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 Santa's face on there. You know, you the Merry Christmas holiday themes. You could definitely know the difference. But again, when I'm strategically shopping, it's not just for that particular holiday. It is for the upcoming holidays or special events or just special occasions or just regular occasions. Birthdays, thinking of you. You know, um, just any occasion. So I'm learning and I'm trying, I'm doing well <laughs> that, um, how I'm st strategically shopping, uh, going forward. You know, you try to do something better for the new year. You always try to do something that's going to benefit you. And the way I am shopping now, um, I think it's working for me. I am going to, uh, after Valentine's Day, I'm going into my garage and, um, cleaning out a lot of things that I have bought. And, you know, when I started doing these hauls, I got so excited about, you know, the green dots, um, the purple dots, you know. So anytime I found a dot, I was just buying stuff, knowing good and well, you know, was thinking maybe, wasn't thinking about how I was designing, just shopping because I was so excited to get the dots. Well, some of that stuff, um, I will probably never use it in my basket. I won't say never, but the way I'm designing my baskets, they're not something that I want to put in my baskets going forward. So my goal is once Valentine's is over, probably the couple of days after Valentine's, after I probably take a couple of days to rest, then um, I'm going to hit my garage and we're just going to get rid of some of the stock stuff. Um, might take it to Goodwill, um, Salvation Army. You know, I want to bless somebody else with it, um, you know, because I, I I can't use it and I don't, I'm not going to use it. So, you know, why not bless somebody else? But if anybody else is in that same situation, hit a sister up and let me know that I'm not out here hanging by myself buying stuff that you probably would never use. Um, but again, thank you guys for watching my channel. Please like, share, comment. If you're out there um, doing any 10 shopping today, let me know the goodies that you found. And again, to the next video, you all enjoy the rest of your Tuesday. Be blessed and have a great day. Goodbye.